Hey guys, what's up? I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to get Citron on your Steam Deck. This will appear in Emulation Station and also your Steam Collections. I will also just leave the text up of the paths that I used for these files. So that way you know what paths that I've been through so you don't have to repeat the video, hopefully. I'll just keep it up the whole video and at the end it might disappear. Anyway, we're gonna go ahead and get started. All the files that are in this video will be supplied to you as well, so don't worry about it. Just check the description to download them. Firstly, you're going to want to go to the Home Deck Emu Deck Emulation Tools Launchers folder. In this directory, you will put citron.sh in there. It'll be next to Sadachi. If you did watch my previous videos, you already know that Sadachi is in here with the rest of the emulators. If you place it in this folder, this will launch in your Steam Collections folder with the rest of the other emulators. So it'll appear as one folder with all the emulators in it within the Steam Collections. The next file path is in the Home Deck Emudeck Emulation ROMs Emulators folder. If you put it in this folder, it'll just appear in the Steam Deck Collections as a separate emulator. So in comparison to the previous location, this will make it not in that folder with the rest of the emulators. If you want it to be separate, you can put it here. The next folder that you'll need to open is the Home ESDE Custom Systems folder. In the custom systems folder, you'll have the es underscore systems.xml. You'll just go ahead and move the other file that I provided and replace this XML file with the one that I have provided for you. This will allow Emulation Station to open up Citron, which just means it adds Citron to Emulation Station. And then finally, all you're going to do is just paste the app image in the Home Applications folder with the rest of the app images. This is just if you want to open it up separately in the desktop mode and just configure some settings like controllers and whatnot. Finally, you just open up Emudeck and you go in there and run the ROM manager. All you need to do in here is just change the theme to classic so you can add a separate emulator, which will be Citron. And essentially, you're just gonna follow what I have here. Use the Nintendo Switch, Yuzu layout. All you'll really do here is just make sure that everything is located in the right areas, which would be your path to ROMs folder where all your games are saved. Just rename the parser title to Nintendo Switch Citron or Nintendo Switch Citron Canary, whatever you want, it really doesn't matter. As for the EXE, you just want to make it the app image. Just select where the app image is, which is in the applications folder. After that, make sure you save and you parse your games after it gets done batching everything you can go ahead and open up the gaming mode for steam everything should work in here just make sure when you go to emulation station that you change it to citron canary as it should appear in there finally i just want to say thank you to everybody that has been subscribing and i hope to continue making more videos like this i try to do them as fast as i can so that way you guys aren't watching a fucking 10 minute video of just random nonsense of trying to get subscribers if you have any questions go ahead and just join my discord it'll be in the description below if you need help that is if not you don't have to join the discord go ahead and leave suggestions below for other videos to be made as well. Peace out guys.